But without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. What's up guys, it's Hunter, I'm back with another unboxing. Um, before I start this unboxing, um, I know in the last box that I uploaded, which is the armor box unboxing, um, I said that I was going to get a short par 4 video for the month of August, I was supposed to, um, but they said that there was an issue with getting my sizes, um, they didn't have it in their system or something, they said, um, so didn't get that box last month. Last month. So we'll be getting a short par four executive box this month, um, so which is September. Um, so that's an update on that uh, for anybody who is waiting for that video. Sorry about that, guys. Um, but this one, it's another armor box unboxing. Um, so when I had done my armor box, I set it up to do it every two months. But last month I really liked it, um, so I decided to do it every month, and. We're back here again. Um, so, Armor Box is a subscription. Uh, it doesn't cost you anything. Um, you go online, you fill out a quiz. Um, I put a video of filling out the quiz and everything in the last Armor Box video. I'll leave a link to that um, in the description. Um, but you go on, you answer questions about what kind of um, activities you like to do, um, how you work out, which kind of clothing style you want. Um, and you're assigned a uh, outfitter, and that person goes through and off your quiz, they um, get you apparel uh, that they think you would like, and they send it to you completely free, and the only thing that you pay for is if you decide you want to keep some of the apparel, uh, then you, have, of course, have to pay for that. Um, and if you keep everything in the box, they give you a pretty good discount. Um, last month, I got a couple of golf polos, I think, um, a pair of shoes, a belt, and a pair of shorts. I believe it was everything from last month, uh, which was kind of more of a golf setup, which is what I picked on a lot of the things that I like to do on my quiz. Um, so one thing that's cool about this is last month, they ended up keeping the shoes and the belts, which is all you have to pay for, is what you keep, um, and you just send the rest back. Uh, but after last month, I communicated with my outfitter, told him he did an awesome job, uh, but told him this month I wanted to kind of go with some more uh, I don't know, like workout clothes, like shorts and sweatpants and t-shirts and stuff like that. And he, he came through. Um, whenever the box gets delivered, you get an alert and it tells you, uh, basically shows you everything that's in your box because you have to click on what you're keeping. So I already know what's in here, but without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Um, so right off the top here, nice, uh, nice packaging there, just like last month. Uh, as you can see in there, it's all nicely wrapped, put into the box. Um, so, we started here. Um, first thing on the top, well, actually, let's get the paperwork out. Okay, so paperwork comes in the red envelope here with the Under Armour logo on it. Uh, let's see. Put that to the side. So, on top, I have a note from my outfitter, Steven. It says, hey, Hunter, ready for your next round of Armour Box? Let's start with your shirt options. Um, both shirts wick sweat to keep you dry and comfortable in the gym. Pair your shirts with the seamless or armor fleece pants when you're ready to hit the gym or on town. These will help you to move restriction free and are built to last even through the toughest workouts. With fall and winter around the corner, I also threw in the rival fleece hoodie. Can't wait to hear what you think and remember you can exchange any item for a different size or color. So that is something I forgot to mention. If you get something and it doesn't fit or you really like it, but you just want it in a different color, you can always exchange it and they'll send you what you want. Uh, this just tells you about, you decide what you want. You have seven days to decide what you want. Uh, what you want to keep, you send back, or you keep, and then you send everything else back and you just pay for what you keep. Uh, this card here is gonna be a breakdown of the pricing for everything. Um, and then these are just stuff for returns. Uh, so go ahead and give you a breakdown. Um, in total, if you were to go to the store and buy all these at regular MSRP, it'd be $229.99. Um, but if you decide to keep everything, you get a 20% discount, which saves me 46 bucks. And then after taxes, if I kept everything, it'd be $195.03. Um, that is 
pretty steep. It's under armor. It's going to be steep. Probably won't keep everything. There are a couple things that I saw that I think I'm going to really like, so I might keep them. Um, so, first off, let's go with right here on top, the Under Armour hat. It's called the Under Armour Armor Vent Training Cap. Um, so, it's the uh, Armor Vent Series. It's got a UPF 30 on it. Um, it says it delivers maximum breathability. Um, it's got the classic fit. Um, so nice. It's a really cool, it's a really good color red. Really like that color. Um, and then the Under Armour logo, it's kind of like a, I wouldn't say black and I wouldn't say gray. It's kind of in between there. Uh, and then you have the words Under Armour written across the back there. Nice hat. It's got the gray trim on the inside. Um, said nice hat. I don't know if I'll keep that. I've got a bunch of hats. Um, let's see. Go ahead and tear this open. On top, this is one of the shirts he was talking about. Wow, this shirt is really soft. Um, let's see what this one is called. I think this is probably going to be the big logo. Um, it doesn't say, um, but I'm going to assume this is the Under Armour big logo sweat or logo short sleeve t-shirt. So nice gray t-shirt there um, with the maroon Under Armour logo there. Let's see if you can see that. Maroon Under Armour logo there. Um, nice soft shirt, like I said. Uh, the maroon's kind of got, the maroon logo's kind of got like a white trim around the outline there. Um, right size and everything. I might keep this shirt, it's 25 bucks. Um, if this is, I think I'm pretty sure this is it. Yeah, this one's 25. I might go with that. It's a nice shirt there. Um, let's see. The next, we have another t-shirt. Um, this is kind of like the same maroon color that the logo on the other shirt was. Um, but it's got the big red uh, UA with some design on the front. And it says Under Armour underneath there. Um, and then on the back, it's just pretty much blank. Other than like the Under Armour logo right up there on the top around the neckline. Um, this is heat gear as well, um, so this shirt would be thirty dollars. I kind of like this one too. I might, I'm gonna have to decide between which one I want to keep. Um, so let's see. Next up is a pair of shorts. These are nice. I haven't seen any other shorts like this in the store, um, but it's just a basic plain black pair of shorts. I don't know if this will show up very well on the camera, but it's on the side of the legs. I don't know if you can actually see that or not. It's like a, it's a dotted pattern. Um, it's a little bit lighter in color. But that dotted pattern goes up the legs, like just below the waistline, and then down to the other leg. Um, it's a nice pair of shorts. Um, let's see, these are $50. It's a really nice pair of shorts. I don't know about keeping them because they're 50 bucks. I usually try and find like Under Armour Nike shorts on sale because it's kind of expensive but these have like a really thick waistline that will definitely um, keep them held up um, when you're wearing them especially if you've got like your phone or your keys or your wallet or something in your pocket got a nice thick waistline that will keep them hold, held up uh, let's see next up is going to be the hoodie he mentioned this hoodie looks awesome um, it's only 45 bucks. That's a pretty good price for an Under Armour hoodie. Nice, just basic black hoodie with the uh, white Under Armour logo with the white square around it. Uh, not too flashy, uh, which is something you don't, when you're kind of working out in clothes like that, you don't want anything too flashy. Just plain black on the back. Nice little hoodie though. Um, it's kind of like the fleece material. Yeah, they call it the Rival Fleece logo hoodie. Um, like I said, 45 bucks. This might be an item I keep. Can always get, uh, use some more shirts, right? Um, let's see. And the last item this month is a pair of uh, sweatpants. Uh, just plain black sweatpants. Um, they've got the Under Armour logo there um, on the leg. Uh, 
They've got Under Armour written inside the waistband there. Um, these feel like they'd be pretty warm. Uh, these are, yeah, they're in the inside of these is fleece as well. Uh, so definitely keep you warm uh, during the fall and the winter. And then these sweatpants are $55. Uh, so pretty nice little haul here. Uh, Steven did a really good job. I asked him for some sweatpants and shorts and t-shirts and he, he came through for me. Um, just so to recap, uh, the red hat, $24.99. The sweatpants were $55. The hoodie was $45. The shorts were $50. Um, this maroon shirt was $30. And the gray shirt was $25. Total of $229.99 with keep it all the discount and after taxes $195.03. Um, I don't know, I might keep the sweatpants and man. I, had, I think this haul might be a little bit more expensive than the last one. So I think I'm gonna go with the sweatpants, uh, maybe one of the shirts and probably the hoodie. I only have one Under Armour hoodie and I've had it for a while and I really like Under Armour's hoodies. Um, so that's everything in Armour Box this month, guys. Um, like I said, short part four should be coming up here in a couple weeks. So if you want to know when I get that uh, box in and get the video up, I'm usually one of the first ones um, with these boxes. Uh, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and push the bell, and you'll get alerts whenever I post. Um, as always, guys, if anything to share, leave it in the comments. Give me a like um, if you like this video. Uh, any Anything you want me to try out, as far as a subscription or anything like that, uh, leave it down in the comments and I'll look into it. Maybe I can try something new that you guys know about that I don't know about. Um, so second month with Armor Box, really please. Um, probably gonna give it another month. I still gotta decide on what I wanna keep because this I think this one's gonna be a little bit more expensive than the last one, like I said. Um, but thanks for watching, guys. And I'll, as always, have a good one.